What's up, everybody? I'm here to do a, a video real quick, and it, it needs to be real quick <laughs> because I'm actually getting ready for work. But uh, I have to do this video just because I did not hear from the winners of my two recent um, giveaways. So one of them has actually already been worked out behind the scenes because uh, I just happened to be back and forth in contact with Dan Bat Silva. And, uh, yeah, he actually ended up behind the scenes winning the... Uh, the Batman figure, the Kenner Batman figure. So, uh, you know, since we were in contact already, I figured I didn't need to actually do that in the video. I just went ahead and um, let him know that I sent that his way. In fact, I already sent it out. So, uh, yeah, you know, congratulations to him for that. And he's a big Batman fan. So, yeah, I'm, I'm, I just know that it'll fit well into his collection. So, those of you that also were in that giveaway, that Batman giveaway, don't feel left out because... I actually decided to go ahead and move your names over to the secret giveaway that I did recently, which was based off of my last Funko News video. So in order to be involved in the secret giveaway, obviously you didn't know about it up front. That's why I call it secret. But you had to have commented and then answered, uh, you know, at least one of the questions that I was throwing out throughout the video. That's how I based that this on. So that's why you see some names here twice. And, um... I'm going to scroll down to show you something here real quick. I'm not going to read all these names because I just don't have the time here. But Michael C. actually does have his name here four times. And that is because he, uh, on the Funko News video, he did comment. He answered one of the questions. And then as a part of the Batman giveaway, he did enter that. And he was one of only two people that were able to tell me which comic I showed a page from. So, yeah, that's why he has his name here four times. So, everybody here, I'm pretty comfortable with this, this list because... Uh, most of you I'm pretty familiar with, and I know that you're not just about giveaways, and I really do appreciate your support. It's unfortunate that I have to do a drawing again, but I know some people may not watch certain videos on my channel because they are longer videos, but this is the way I look at it. If I say a drawing is going to be on a certain date, and I only put up one video that day, to me, I think it makes it clear that the the giveaway um, drawing must be a part of that video and especially with my Saturday Night Vlogs I've done drawings within those videos before so I, I really do you know uh, appreciate the winners their support as well the previous winners but I mean fair is fair to the rest of you all they did not contact me and I even gave it an extra day because my Saturday Night Vlog took so long to upload it really didn't go up until Sunday morning so I felt like it was fair to give at least one more day which I did and I did not hear from either one of them so I mean it kinda is what it is at that point but you know I, I still appreciate them you know in their support of the channel no hard feelings at all I really do appreciate them just a quick reminder before I do this drawing again um, you have a choice if you win between Sabine and Miss Marvel okay both of these Walgreens exclusives and I like to use Walgreens exclusives for giveaways just because my Walgreens are pretty good and I know a lot of you have a lot of trouble with Walgreens so that's why I tend to like to focus on these figures but enough about that let me go ahead and get to this actual drawing so we can see who the winner is this time and I really hope that I, I get contacted by somebody because I'm not gonna do this a third time it's just it's a little disheartening if I would have to do that. So this this is going to be it here, and I really do hope that I hear from the winner. So here, here we go. We'll go with the fruit machine. And you're not going to hear the sound. I decided to turn it off because I am getting ready to go to work. Um, oh, and there we go, Michael C. I mean, he had the best eyes, so that's not a big surprise there. So, yeah, Michael, really hope that I hear from you. I, I really don't want to have to... Um, you know, find something else to do with these figures here because, I mean, obviously one of them I'm going to end up doing something else with anyway because I'm just offering up one for right now. And the reason why it's just going to be one figure, um, whew, when it comes to shipping, I'm getting murdered lately and I just don't have a lot of money to throw around, just to be real about it. As a matter of fact, that's the reason why, let me go ahead and let you all know quickly, and I may bring this up in another video sometime soon, but... You, those of you watching this video, you're getting the heads up on this. So, February actually marks my one year on YouTube, you know, taking it seriously. As a matter of fact, February 6th is the first date that I, I put up a serious video that I consider, you know, to be a serious video as far as focused on what my channel is going to be about. So, I actually put up my first collection video on February 6th of last year. So, um, yeah, you might want to go back and check that out. I think it's pretty cool. But, uh, yeah, so... 
I do want to kind of do some something of somewhat of a celebration for February, even though for the most part, I want to keep things business as usual on my channel. I kind of like the way that things are going. I like the support that I'm getting. You know, I'm very appreciative of that. So I don't really want to mix things up too much, you know, and, and do anything too elaborate. But I definitely do want to acknowledge this year of work that I've really put into it. It's been fun, but it has also been work as well. And um, I also want to show some appreciation for the community. So what I finally decided to do, I was really racking my brain for it. And I had some ideas and I got some feedback from friends and they thought I was crazy with some of my ideas. And I can see where they're coming from. So I really do take their advice to heart. So what I ended up deciding to do, though, is that for the month of February, I'm going to give it to the end of the month. Probably will take it all the way to the very end of the month. And um and I'll do a drawing and the drawing is going to include people that that I feel are very supportive of the channel people that I'm seeing comment on a regular basis and actually you know commenting with something that's significant not just good video you know you know like, like just very simplistic things because there are some comments I see makes me wonder if somebody actually watched the video especially if I just posted the video and somebody comments like 30 seconds later I'm like okay but, you know, so the people that I feel are very supportive, um, you will be entered into this giveaway that I'm going to have at the end of this month. And instead of giving a figure, what I'm going to do is give a gift card. Now, it might be a GameStop gift card. I think that'd probably be the easiest just because most people have access to GameStop. Or it could be, um, you know, maybe a bookstore like Barnes & Noble or Books A Million. I'll work that out with whoever the winner is, which store you want it to focus on. And as far as the amount is concerned, this is the way it's going to be set. Now, I always say on my channel, it's not about the numbers, but at the same time, I mean, you know, it, it kind of it's kind of ridiculous to do YouTube and not consider your audience size at all, you know, especially with all the work that I put into this. So this is what I'm going to do. The simplest way to keep up with the amount is and let me show you all here real quick. So. Right now, as of this recording, for my subscribers, I have 465. And by the way, I, I do realize some of you have, have been, been having trouble with um, your account automatically unsubscribing you. I know tolly has been having that issue. And Tolly, I really do hope you report that and get that worked out with YouTube. But, um, yeah, so some of you have been being dropped and then you were subscribed back. And I do appreciate you making sure that you subscribe back to me. But, yeah, the, uh, right now... I have 465 subscribers, and the most recent one here is Joaquin Renatos. I hope I'm saying that name correctly. So I'm actually going to watch this screen because I know the numbers can be kind of funny, and some people may have their account set to private, but I want to see legitimate subscribers. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to base the uh, amount of the gift card off of how many subscribers I get for the month of February. So so again, I'm at 465 right now. So let's say that I end up with maybe 18 new subscribers. I'm just throwing a random number out, 18. I'll basically round that up to 20, and that means that the winner will get a $20 gift card. Now, if I let's say that I end up with like maybe, I don't know, 52 subscribers. Let's say I get 52 new subscribers then I would still round it up to like the $5 increment. I'd probably, you know, give a $55 gift card. So that's the way that this giveaway is going to work. I'm going to base it off of my number of subscribers that I get for this month. So if you want to help promote the channel, that's cool. Please don't try anything slick, though. I know I did a, a giveaway last year that was related to my number of subscribers and I had somebody actually and I'm, I'm assuming that it was a kid that did this that because it, it just was very careless and very cheap but basically this person was creating false accounts and adding them on to my, my subscriber account and I really I recognized that you know so and I called them out on that of course so yeah let's keep it legitimate you know I do want legitimate growth but if you want to campaign some for the channel to help that number get up there so that you know, if you win, you'll have a bigger amount for the gift card. I'm fine with that, but let's do keep it legitimate, though. So, yeah, that's the way it's going to work, and that's going to save me on some shipping. You know, I could just put a gift card in an um, envelope or either, you know, even just give you the number. You know, in some cases, that would work as well. So we'll work that out. But, yeah, that's the way it's going to work. So, yeah, like I said, February, you know, it marks one year for me, and... What a year has been. I may do sort of a reflection, a quick reflection type video um, 
you know, we'll see. But like I said, I don't want to do anything too elaborate. I just really just want to keep things moving. And I'm very appreciative of all the support. And let me stop rambling because I got to get to work. But yeah, thank you all for watching. And uh, I'll talk to you all again real soon.